Welcome to Incubators Africa and in today's video we'll be uh, unboxing our 36 egg incubator. So don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. So once you're taking your units out the box, you'll be taking your packaging off. And then inside you'll get a box which you can take out for now. You'll have a, a piece that you can slide right off. Here we'll take our base off. So once you've taken your uh, machine out from the box, on the smaller box you'll have your plug. You'll also have uh, your motor, which I'll show you where to connect and your working manual and your tray which we're going to assemble now so before you start uh, your motor will easily fit onto uh, the round piece in imitation inside the unit that clips nicely so once you've done that uh, this is going to be your tray where that little uh, pointy piece sticking out will be fitted into here so that's going to connect your, your tray this is a roller, so you can adjust according to the sizing of the egg uh, that you want to use inside your unit. So you can adjust your, your eggs according to the thickness and the size of your egg. Once you've done so, place those eggs on their side. Once you've done so, just close your lid and then you're going to plug in your unit, which is an easy step. It's a plug and play. Your connection to your unit is over here at the back. So once you've plugged in your unit, you can add 20 to 30 mils of water into your tray, which uh, you can disperse it through all. Try and not put too much water, 20 to 30 mils is more than enough. So once you've added your water, your eggs are inside, what we would like to do is push set button just once, use your down or up arrow to increase or decrease uh, temperature which we want 37.5. Once there, push a set button so it's then preset for you, as this is gonna be your display for your heat. Over here, we have humidity, which is the amount of water you have inside, which you want it between 50 and 70%. If it drops below, it will trigger an alarm to let you know you need to add some more water. So you'll just by adding by opening your drawer. Then your temperature will maintain itself, so there's no need to worry there. Um, when your heat is on, it will show a light to say your heat has indicated that it's on. Once it reaches temperature, it will switch off. Over here, you have an, a single LED light to test your eggs, which is always a sharp point facing down from day 10. Um, once you place your egg in, switch on the light in a dark room. If the light shines through the egg, the egg is no good. If that uh, light bounces back and it can't go through the egg, the egg is perfect. And then once finished, just switch off so we're not in use and then your eggs will roll uh, every two hours for you when you come to chicken eggs and it comes to day eight, at the end of day 18 beginning of day 19 you can lift your lid you can take your uh, divisions out from the eggs and then lastly your egg tray will come out so the eggs are standing free and then close your lid and then you can check your water by adding 10 to 15 mils if needed once that's so, your chicks will start hatching from day 21 to 24 and then afterwards you can repeat the process. Just remember, never spray or wash the unit physically with water and don't forget to like and subscribe to this video.